Hey guys! In Letterland, we've been learning about the vowel stealers. Remember, whenever you have a vowel stealer in a word, it's an R that is stealing a vowel, and the vowel is not able to say its normal vowel sound. So last week, we learned a little bit about Arthur R. Arthur R is a robot that steals A's. He steals apples, and they're not able to make their normal A or A sound. Then we also have Orville Orr. Orville Orr steals O's or oranges in Letterland, and they don't make their normal A ah or O sound. They say or. This week we're learning about the Ur brothers. Now there are three Ur brothers, and if you look on the picture on the screen, you can see that they look almost identical. And in fact, they sound identical, but they are not. In fact, it's really silly. They like to spell their last name just a little bit differently. So yesterday you learned a little bit about Ernest Er. Ernest Er, he steals elephants, he steals E's. Tomorrow you get to hear about Irving Er. Irving Er, he steals MB inks, he steals eyes. And I am going to teach you a little bit today about Urgent Er. Urgent Er, we're gonna talk about what he steals here in a second. But before we do, I want you to notice what each of these brothers is wearing on their feet. This is one of the ways that you can tell them apart. You ready? Okay, so are you looking at their feet? Oh, okay, so Ernest Er, he has on tennis shoes. Urgent Er, he has on boots, and Irving Er, he has on roller skates. <gasps> so, if you had to look at these two, who do you think would be a little faster? Yep, you're right. I think it would be Ernest Er. Urgent Er, he wears what on his feet? That's right, he wears purple fur boots, purple fur boots. And the words purple and fur both have er in them. Let's write those real quick. Purple. Purple. And I even used the color purple. And fur. Fur. Purple and fur. All right, so now let's talk about the vowel that Urgent Er is stealing. Who is that? It's Uppy Umbrella. And if you look, Uppy Umbrella does not look happy. Look at the face that, that, that she's making. Can you make a face like Uppy Umbrella? She looks very sad. She's not happy about being captured, not at all. Okay. So if you look at the picture, you can kind of see where Urgent Er is running away with the umbrella that he's stolen. Do you see him on the picture? He's running down a road. And he better be careful because as he's running down the road, he better not trip on the curb. Have you ever seen a curb, like a, a curb on the street where it goes up? So curb, he better not trip on that curb. Here I have my road, and here we have the curb before you get to the grass. All right, hope he doesn't trip on the curb. If he trips on the curb, he might get hurt. He might trip and get hurt. Hurt is a Band-Aid. Hope he doesn't get hurt. If he gets too hurt, he might even have to go and see a nurse. Oh my, hopefully not. Nurse. Here we have a nurse. So urgent er is in each of those words. 
he is in the word curb and hurt and nurse. Do you see him in there? Very good. Okay, so whenever he catches an umbrella, a talking umbrella, he carries it behind his back and he takes out his little mobile phone, his little phone, and he says, er, urgent, er. He's like, I've captured an umbrella, er. Can you do that with me? I've captured an umbrella, er. You have to say it with a robot voice because he is a robot. So, anytime that you see an R with an umbrella behind its back, like they're, that they're stealing it, he's not gonna fool you because you're gonna know that it's urgent, er, urgent, er. And I have a trick question for you before I leave. So can you think of two days of the week that are urgent er's favorite days? Hmm. Let's think. There's Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Saturday. Yep, his two favorite days are Thursday and Saturday. All right, before we go, I'm going to show you just his plain letter sight, and we're going to say his sound three times. You ready? Err, err, err. All right, guys, thank you for listening about Urgent Err, and tomorrow you get to hear about a new vowel stealer. Have a great day. Bye.